What's up guys, it's your boy Ares the Greek, and welcome to episode 27 of my long road to the ghillie suit. Before I even get started though, let me go ahead and update you guys on my kills before I forget. I'm at 560 kills, so we're actually further along than I thought in the last video. I went ahead and guessed and I said I think we're at about 500 kills, so we're up about 60 kills of what I thought, and that's good news considering I'm trying to knock this out by mid-February, so we might still be on track. It's going to be a challenge, but hopefully we can get it done here in the next two weeks. We got two weeks to go, so I don't know. I don't know, guys. It's going to be close. I'm going to try my best. I'm going to start knocking these out, man. I might even start doing two videos a day. But like I said, the problem with trying to do more videos is I'm just it would just flood my YouTube page. It's like I don't want to only do Road to the Gillies. Like, it would just be played out so bad if I just do two a day you know what i'm saying so i don't know maybe one a day i'll go ahead and do the math and see if if i could get like 10 to 15 kills a game if i would get there but i'm trying i don't know i'm terrible at math so i need a calculator to even start to think about it but also guys i am using the 360 controller in this one so let me go ahead and tell you that and i'm scared that it might throw me off a little bit but so far i started out okay so it hadn't really affected me. But if you watched the last video I posted, you guys would know I've had all sorts of problems with the Xbox One today. So I am actually switched back to the 360 in this video. And the controller on it, ah, man, as much as I loved it in the past, I just got used to the Xbox One controller. And it's so funny because at first I bashed the Xbox One controller like nothing else. Like that was the only problem I had with the Xbox One at first. I was like, yeah, this fucking controller is fucking terrible. I fucking hate it. And now it's just I've gotten used to that and I love the Xbox One controller. I really do. It's so much better than the 360. So everything bad I have to say about the Xbox One, the only good thing I can really say is the controller. It's a lot better. Because I use this 360 controller now and it's so heavy for one. It really is. It's just so much heavier. And the joysticks just don't move as easy. It makes it harder to move around. And it's funny because, you know, I played the 360 for so long. Like since it came out. Like, I've had the 360 pretty much. So it's like all those years of getting used to that controller, you would think I would just be able to go back to it and it'd be okay. But no, after a month of using the Xbox One, I've already gotten used to that. And I can't really go back to the 360. But, I don't know. I'll have to get used to it again. I got a feeling I'm going to be using the 360 a lot more now. Just because I'm so fed up with the Xbox One. I'm just done with that. But I don't know. I'm actually surprised though. Before I get back onto an Xbox One rant, let me quickly switch off of that topic. I am surprised I've started out so well on this map. And it's just really because I don't play this map. I don't know this map. It's just, I don't know. Where the fuck did he shoot me from? Ah, fuck. It's just, I don't really know where to go. I just, I've had this problem in the last one. I think the last video I actually made of me sniping on this map, I played pretty well. But that's probably the last time I played this map. There's a couple maps that I just don't play in this game. And this is one of them. And Siege, I don't play Siege. I don't know. So it, I, I just don't get used to the maps. Like, for instance, if I pulled Prison Break, I know exactly what to do on Prison Break. I know where people are going to go. I know the tendencies of people. I That was a pretty nice snipe. You know what I'm saying? But then I pulled this map. I honestly... I would not kind of know what to do on an assault rifle. Like, I would sit in this room right here and kind of just, I don't kind of camp it in a way. But here, with the sniper, I don't know. People love to sit in the other room. I've been kind of just camping right here, and it's worked out. So, I don't know. I think I'm just going to continue to sit here and hope the snipes come. That's about all I can do. I love 15 kills. Oh, fuck me, man. We're definitely going to chill in here now. Wait for that helicopter to go away. I'm not trying to die to that shit. Plus, they seem just to be running in like retards. That's the funny thing about Call of Duty players. And Joe's, uh, if someone's just playing really good from a spot and you'd like... We all do it. Here, I'll, I'll kind of phrase it in a different way when I was going to go. We all do it. So, say someone's wrecking you. You're just getting wrecked. And they're camping in a spot. More than likely, you're going to run back to that spot just because they've pissed you off now. You're like, fuck that. They're not going to kill me. I'm going to go try to kill them again. And we all do it. It's just funny. I don't know why we do. It's probably not the smartest gameplay necessarily because, oh, fuck yeah. Just because they've got their spot, more than likely they're going to wreck you. They know where you're running into. It's more frustration, I think, that gets them. Because I guess this is a pretty popular little room. 
Ah, I'm actually sniping pretty well, though. And I'm surprised. I am. Because, like I said, the controller, I really thought I was going to be a little bit off. And that just hasn't happened. I've been about the same, so that's always good. Now, if I can just get to 15. Just get me to 15. Ah, fuck. No. Come on, come on, come on. Ah, fuck me. He wouldn't run in that way. That's okay. You know how happy that kid is right now? He's just so happy. He's like, fuck yeah. I finally killed him. <laughs> fuck that guy. Fuck his noise. They fucked me up. Ah, oh, man. I don't know. I'm just, I'm kind of scared just because I don't know where anyone's at. I don't know where to go. Oh, boy. Oh, jeez. Where do I go? Oh, come on, new. Oh, my God, no. Oh, my God. Ah, oh, this is super embarrassing, guy. I am just terrible on the long range. I just always will be. Everyone just ignore that that just even happened right there. Just fucking terrible. Just me in the long range. It just doesn't work out. I don't understand it. People are so good on long range shots. Ah, oh, he just ran. He just literally ran right into my sight. It was like the most perfect situation. I, I'm actually, I've noticed I'm pretty, I don't, I'm not going to say decent because there would be no time ever in my Call of Duty career that I even think I'm a decent sniper. So I'm going to say I'm below average at mid-range. Like that's where I strive. That's my best is mid-range. I struggle short range and long range, mostly short range just because I can't quick scope. I just can't. And I think long range, I don't know why it is that I can't. Maybe if I had the variable zoom, it would still be better, but I took that off just because I'm not that... It's funny because in past Call of Duties, I love the variable zoom. Anytime I sniped, I used the variable zoom, and then I took it off in this one, and I started doing good without it. So, ah, fuck. So I don't know why. I should go back to that because I do think that helps. Oh, I hit him too. Fuck. I do think that helps a little bit on the long range just because you can kind of zoom right up into it. But I don't know. I think I get nervous on long range. Like, my, my thing's always moving around. I'm just, I don't know. I lose confidence. I'm like, oh, there's no way I'm going to hit him. And I think I overthink it. But I don't know what it is. I don't. But we played pretty good. I'm pretty surprised that we played so good. Let's see this snipe. We didn't get to 15, but that is what it is. Wait, did we? No, we got to 13. Ah, disappointing. We missed it by two. How the fuck we miss it by two? But anyway, we'll get it next time. I promise you that. We will get to 15. Hopefully, we get on a better map. I don't know. But anyway, guys, thank you guys for watching. You guys are the best. I love you guys. But this has been your boy, Aries the Greek. <laughs> hey, guys. Peace out.